Every Christmas, we find ourselves returning to the old black and white Christmas classics. A Christmas Carol, It's a Wonderful Life, or if you're Pete Davidson, Raging Bull. On that note, here's a piece we finished filming at 5 a.m. this morning, An Evening with Pete. It's got Pete Davidson, Mikey Day, Chloe Fineman, Chris Redd, Andrew Dismukes, and James Austin Johnson, and Colin Jost, sort of. All right, Pete. You still got it, baby. You're the champ. You can still do update with the best of them. Five minutes, Mr. Davidson. I'll be there in six. Good evening. I'm Colin Jost. Je Here with his thoughts on the state of the world is our resident young, young person, Pete Davidson. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> As you know, I am from Staten Island. Do you guys know the difference between Gilligan's Island and Staten Island? One's full of a bunch of morons who are stuck there for the rest of their lives, and another one's an old TV show. <laughs> do Chad! Yeah, no, not gonna do that, pal. Come on, just do Chad! You can't just do Chad, okay? It takes two people, it's like a whole thing. Come on, just do it! Do Chad! All right, fine. If you want Chad, I'll do Chad. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Pete Davidson, everyone. One, 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 one. Hi, my name is. What? My name is. Who? My name is. Wicked, wicked, warm baby. Who exactly is the audience for this? I don't know. God, he's sweating like a pig. Yeah, he eats a whole turkey before coming on stage every night. God. Hey, boss, uh, some guy's outside saying he knows you, trying to jump the line. Says he's the right for you or something like that. Hey! Pete! Hey, it's your old pal, Eddie Corbin. I, I, I brought you a Christmas present. Never seen him before in my life. But, no, wait, Pete, I, we shared an office together. I, I wrote all your updates and your sketches for you. I stayed up all night working while, while you went to Knicks games. What do you want? A medal? Get out of here, you bum! Oh. Shut the door! It's okay, Pete. It's, it's good to see you. What? Just text me what, whatever. Thank you, thank you. Next, I'd like to do a song with my dear friend, Machine Gun Kelly. <laughs> I'll take the first verse. So there I was completely dressed as the Grinch, about to get into a fight with that no-neck guy from 90 Day Fiance. That's great. I gotta go, actually. Uh, okay. How about you, ladies? Would you like another drink? Cold night, huh? Yeah. Pete? Come on, bud. We have a lot of catching up to do. <laughs> <laughs> you guys know how I was a famous sex symbol for reasons no one could understand. Yeah. This is the guy who came up with that. He told me to do that. Seriously? How did you come up with that? Well, I woke up in the middle of the night and I jotted it down. The rest is history. Was it also his idea of to like cover your body in tattoos and then painfully remove them one by one? <laughs> sure. Listen, Eddie, I know you never got the credit you deserved. So I want you to have this. It's one of my Oscars. Oh, wow. Viola Davis Lifetime Achievement Award. 
Pete, where did you get this? Well, do you want it or not? What, yeah, no, get you. Yeah, thank you. Well, folks, it's been a great night. I hope you all have a Merry Christmas. And remember, it's not Christmas without fireworks and hot dogs. That's Fourth of July, Pete. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Anyway, we've come to the end of the show, which means it's time for me to say goodbye for now. We'll see each other again. You know that I am always near. You know that I'll be waiting here for you.